Okay guys, a uh, quick little video for you here and uh, we'll show you a new addition to the farm. Now, uh, <clears throat> one of the skill sets that you need to have is bartering, trading, uh, horse trading, uh, negotiation, and I'll show you exactly uh, how I did on this uh, new little UTV here and uh, you tell me how, how you think I did. Uh, but in uh, in uh, bad times, uh, shit at the fan situation, uh, being able to barter for things, whether it be food or ammunition or clothing or shelter or uh, supplies, uh, bartering is going to be something you need to know how to do and feel comfortable doing it. So, uh, this is a new Kubota, uh, the new 1140 RTV 4 seat 4x4. Uh, they list for about... Twenty-seven, twenty-eight thousand dollars uh, if you go get one at a dealer and the problem is is it's hard to find the new vehicles with all of these shortages that they're having uh, with parts and chips and things uh, being able to find a new one is impossible uh, you can order them and they're about a year out uh, a lot of y'all saw that i had the razor here a while back uh, well, uh, the wife didn't like it too loud, too fast, too much air. Uh, so uh, <clears throat> that's when we got the Jeep. And uh, y'all guys know, uh, y'all saw my Jeep. I did a video on it. And, uh, you know, I crashed into the tree down there and totaled it. Uh, so the insurance company paid on it. And uh, if y'all have watched the channel, you know that I got a uh, Kubota uh, two-seater. It was the uh, 900 RTV. And uh, I had a guy come by the other night and offer me a very decent price for that Kubota for the two-seat model. And uh, y'all know I got kids, so I've been looking to upgrade to a four-seater for a while. Uh, but with the money that he gave me, uh, I bought my other Kubota for 10000 about four years ago. And uh, I have used it for three to four years here on the farm. Put a couple hundred hours on it and about a thousand miles. And the guy offered me thirteen five for my used Kubota. Well, considering what I had given for it and used it, well, I took him up on the offer and took the thirteen five for the Kubota. Uh, Y'all know the Jeep got totaled and uh, the insurance company was going to pay off on it. Uh, and they did. And I had the option to buy the Jeep back uh, for $5,000 salvage, uh, which I did. Uh, well, this guy had uh, bought this Kubota and driven it around his farm. You can see it's basically new. I think it's got 22 miles on it. Uh, but his wife didn't like it. It was too loud and uh, a lot bigger than their golf cart. So he decided to sell it. Well, he had it posted uh, for $23,500. So what I did is offer him uh, 15,000 cash. The Jeep that I had bought for salvage for 5,000 uh, which if I was going to sell it, I would sell it for more. Uh, but I threw the 15000 the $5,000 Jeep at him, and a uh, Freedom stick that I had about $400 in. And the guy was agreeing upon that. He was really interested in the Jeep, even though it had a salvage title and a bent frame. Uh, he was just going to use it on his farm and around the place. So uh, he was interested in that trade. Uh, so basically, I've got a new... Uh, twenty-seven, twenty-eight thousand dollar UTV uh, for the price of about twenty thousand dollars of my investment, and that is how you try and barter or horse trade, uh, because both of us came out feeling that we got a good deal, and uh, I gave less than what he was asking for it, which is always a good thing, and uh, I'm positive side on my purchase here as in I could probably sell it right now and make money on the deal. Uh, so that is a good barter or a good trade in my book. Uh, y'all let me know what you think down below in the comments. Uh, what some things y'all have bartered for and uh, you usually come out on top or on bottom. Uh, you know a good horse trade is where both parties walk away thinking they got a good deal. And uh, that's kind of what's happened here. So Many adventures yet to come on the uh, new Kubota. Thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate it. Uh, pick up that skill. It's going to be handy to have. 
Thanks for watching. Like, share, and subscribe. Stay safe out there.